Boy DJ Jinx Paul, and let's talk about Beso Lounge. Beso located at Lounge. Lounge. 204th Street in the Bronx. It's the old sandbox, so whoever used to hang out in the sandbox back in the days, hey, it's called Beso Lounge. So check this out. It's a grown and sexy event. It's 23 and over, so you don't have to worry about none of those problematic places or anything like that. It's 23 and over, so it's very sexy, very trendy. We have free valet service and bottle specials of silk, vodka, $100 all night. So hey, you have that special occasion or birthday you want to celebrate? Come and do it with us at Beso Lounge. Beso Lounge rents the whole place to you. If you want to do a birthday, a gathering, any social event, Beso Lounge will take care of you. All you have to do is send an email to Lounge at gmail.com and they'll take care of the rest. Remember, Beso Lounge is located at 320 East, 204th Street in the Bronx. We'll see you there at Beso Lounge. blood type and not just your borough? Did you just take six pics just to post that one selfie? Real men wear beards. Are you part of the BGA? Then we might just have the tea for you. Log on to SodaPopTees.com and check us out today. S-O-T-U-R-P-T-E-E-S dot com, baby. Go ahead. Pop the top. Soda Pop. Yeah, you already know what it is. It's your girl, Pazzy Maserati, also known as Miss Hip Hop. And you to UEG Radio, one of my favorite internet radio stations. So keep it locked. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Please select your destination. Nightline Radio. 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 Fourth corner, boys. 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 We the best. Yeah. It's real. Yo, it's one of the fucking. It's one of the hottest DJs. Shout out to the big homie, Tim Tonkin. Let's go, New York City. We here. Yeah. It's froze, but a hot nigga. Yup. Need the Henny, Remy, or Ciroc, nigga. Catch a shot, nah. You can catch a lot, nigga. Don't get your liquid all over the rocks, nigga. Let's go. And Bizzle keep it on them, try to plot, nigga. Give you 50, but you gon' need the dot quicker. Bitches lurking like, who is he? Get your dot, nigga. Money, power, respect, the rocks, nigga. Who the boy? Who the boy? Who the boy? Radio, we live on a Wednesday night. You know what it is. Know Shout out to the boy Elliot man. Ness, Johnny Stone. He's here, dogs below. What's up, though? Tim Tonkin's on this one. Shout out to the Spurs, yep. too, man. Y'all niggas killed this shit. Y'all niggas got this shit lit right now. Brooklyn, stand up. Jello Beats, holla at Let's go. It's Rose, but a hot nigga. Yeah. Need the Henny, Remy, or Ciroc, nigga Let's go, baby shot, nah, you can catch a lot, nigga Dang. Don't get your liquid all over the rocks, nigga Dang. And Bizzle keep it Yes. Yeah, give you 50, but you gon' need to die quicker. Let's go. Just lurking like who is he? Get your die, nigga. Money, power, respect, money from the box, nigga. All you broke niggas, what I laugh about. Flash cash, ask the haters what they mad. Let's go, Frost the Colas. I'm about to pass out. You need that dope sour average. Ah. Out and yeah, I snuff my teacher in his six. Got suspended, but was chilling like for six days. Fuck with bloods, fuck with crips, sound game. This that hot nigga freestyle. Let's Hey, Shorty trying to show me what a jaws bow. Draws bow. That's for my niggas, what them hoes bow. Hoes bow. You all be in with you the wall round. But the bit is the money, that's what we more bow. Free Junior, though, they won't let my cuz out. Fuck you, bitches, ratting like he giving drugs out. That's what get you niggas buried in the dugout. Free man, no, they won't let my bra out. We give orders to them troops like Barack on them. They see the hoopty circle, they gon' call the cops on them. Swats on them, screaming thug life, like I'm Pac on them. Low you niggas, that's what we are. We are putting grimy niggas in the ER. 
R. UBG, huh? But bitch, if it's a problem, we could gun fight. My nigga send me automatic, that's they gun type. And the pussy motherfuckers, they lunch type. King of the kitchen, his beat was left dead. Let's go. Homie was standing over the UBG. That's on the rag, motherfucker. Best believe it, Joe. Believe it, Joe. No, we don't fuck around like a TR. My killers, killers, they ain't tweeting, yo. You who we get that close casket and digging for. Frost the coldest. Brooklyn, what's up, Brooklyn? You what was Hold up. Shout to the boy Juice Jones. Come get you some 336. Uh. Greensboro, North Carolina. Money Mills. Money Mills. Juice motherfucking Jones. Crazy New York. Wednesday nights, we here. UEG. Download beats. Ha! Yeah. Others get their front on. I be called. Yeah. Cockpit dashboard reading out my six. Juice Jones, what's up though? Greensboro, North Carolina, what's up though? We in that 336 real heavy New York City. I'm here. Money Mills. Money Mills. Juice motherfucking Jones. This is a different record. Other record. Other record. Untouchable one day. Jello beats. Holla at us. Nice. Come on! Loud smoke cheaper with my people, I'm a stun on while others get their front on. I be called yeah. the cockpit dashboard. Juice Jones! Moss birds screaming like an ostrich. I get bitches, I ain't gotta hold them hostage. A team player just like you ain't in his prime. I'm a boss on the block, got some nickels for the time. Uh, I said, watch me do my dance, ho. I'm yeah. Fly screaming, watch me do my dance. Yeah. We on the street, we don't even need a dance. Huh? I'm trap on jumping, I just made money mills. In my hood, no niggas with them crack rocks. Fuck 12, they be getting on my damn Yes. Box. Couple bandos, couple trap spots, couple AKs, couple red dots. <laughs> Catch me cooling with a bad bitch. Yeah. Hey. I bet you fuck with the ass. Do your smoney dance. Yeah, shout it, light it up and pass. Do your smoney dance. Last play, Griffin. Bring the beat in light. Oh, wait till it drop. What you gon' do? Just a young nigga doing what I'm supposed to. So go do your dance, ho. Walk through, I just made me a band out. Uh, I said, watch me do my dance, ho. We on that block. Let yep. me do my dance, ho. Yep. We on the street. We don't even need a dance. Blow my trap phone jumping. I just made me a band. Shout to my brother Oom P. BX what's up though? It's Oom P. I don't think you niggas want to go from zero to a hundred. Success is a bitch. Get the feeling that she coming. Now the money coming to me. I remember it was running. When I got myself in shape, catching up to it was nothing. Grind hard to get this chicken and I was proud to. Money don't grow on trees, but this loud do. I'm KO with niggas in round one. Fuck round two. If niggas that you hang with is clowns, then you a clown too. They don't want to see me make it off rap. They rather me on the corner trying to make it off crack. Blowing money in the mall just to make it all back Shit, my credit card gold, I'm trying to what, make what, it what? all black If you hate to suck a dick, you could take a long nap Run the train on your bitch, you try to get me off track Go ahead, you fucking with the wrong cat So before you fall victim, you better f*** back Yeah Deuce, nigga Coming real quick, real quick yeah, I could buy my business and that be all. Hold on, he ain't talking money. UEG fam, toast. What up, toast? Yeah, uptown. What it is, huh? Coming real quick, real quick. UEG, nigga, real quick. Salini music, yeah, nigga, that's where it's at. Pirelli on that 19, riding with a left. Yeah. Lane. I could buy in my business and that be all. If we ain't talking money, then why we talking at all? What else, Toast? See, here's where you dummies crash. Wanna act like we cool, but your phone don't even have my map. Same niggas that be talking about I'm changing. But if you ask them, they wouldn't know where my change Not at all. <laughs> you never been around here. You never played around here. You never scored around here. Yeah. Figure it out while I be the clip of the shade. Yeah. Selene music once again, my problem. If they was, you would know I don't pretend. I don't pretend nigga. Shout to my ghost followers. Best free promotion, cause your mouth never bottled up. No, no, no. One time for my Brooklyn niggas. Two times for my 
my feelings. Send the UEG ladies, what's up, my man? For my high still is always got love for my BX and my queens. Yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, trying to get it. What are you doing? Are you still doing? flashing re up money when you use Shout the dough boy, what's up? I just call him walking room. Yeah, my nigga burn said you can never win from losing. Yeah, let's go. I'm grinding like a savage with this rap shit. Rap trying to reach on my people that really rap shit. Unwrap shit, re rap shit, hitting trash shit. Yeah. Hoping that they never add another till they rap shit. You can never be me, dummy. What the actor do? I'ma take the real spot. Yes. So I'ma keep feeding facts. I'ma be the open farm. You can get your truth picking that. Forever Rippy 1889. Man, the street fuck with me. Cause yep. the deeds are the final Let's lines. Go. Washington Heights King, that title mine. I invested like a hundred off my own grind. They talking why he ain't perform at win. Cause give a fuck. Not cause they ain't let me in. Mike Jones was the host, that's family. If not, I would have called my brother God. Let's go. The way you niggas gossip is sad. My girl Joyce had to check a nigga talking out his ass. Here's your hashtag fact. You a rapper, I'm a hustler that happened to know how to rap. Yeah. You know what it is when it is what it is. Scales. True, we got it. Frisco Figueroa, Charlie La Melma. I'm about to box you niggas in. The details define the lies. Yeah. Selene, you say, you say, you say. Catch kicks in it, cause I fake. Wanna catch kicks in it, cause I fake. Woo! Let's go. Shout out to my homie Bathgate, what's up? This is a test for the emergency broadcast. Yo! Bad game! <laughs> Do what I want to. Help who I want to. 550 cool panoramic, no sunroof. Do what I want to. Stacks and bumps. Hold on. <laughs> they run to. They don't want you. Catch kicks in it because I'm fake. New York, let's go. New York, let's go. We in Harlem. What up, Harlem? Hey. Bring the beat. Bring the beat in light. This is a test. Hey. For the emergency broadcast system. Let's go. Bring you this test. I'm here. here we go. Do what I want to. Hump who I want to. Yeah. 550 cool panoramic, no sunroof. Do what I want to. Stacks and bundles. I'm something they run to. They don't want you. Now or later. Now get the paper. Be about your bread, man. Screw them haters. My arm is breezy. Mama sees me. 40k, by the way, this is something easy. I go in. Whenever you see me, hey. no win, so friend, don't talk to me greasy. Hey. I get that hammer, I might bring ya. Play with my freedom, cause I might chance ya. My swag is proper, crab or lobster, and I don't do neither. I just watch ya, and I just pop up. She goes opera, and she don't go down, dog. She goes opera. I got my now lady chain and my now lady charm. Bad little kick the kick, now lady calm. We gon' get it in to the get it all gone, so. What you say, what you say, what you say, huh? What you say, what you say, what you say, huh? Give it away, give it away, give it away now. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. What you say, what you say, what you say, huh? What you say, what you say, what you say, huh? Give it away, give it away, give it away now. Now, now, now. Flies a bird, man. My charm's superb, man. She don't follow rules and I tell her to curve, man. White suburban, my legend is urban. Half pink and purple. Man, Gator is back though, uh, you should relax though uh, I'ma tell you some facts though, these niggas is whack yo Try to sit back though, listen to rap folk Just to get annoyed with this shit Let's go bath gate. I'm giving them candy, they giving me panties I give them adventure, they give them insanity You nagging the rest them, I don't ask them I leave them with mystery until I smash them You get wrapped and bag them, throw on a magnum Then simply I trash them and give them back them The seven is wider, the six is faster I cruise to the bank for like Tom would like I got my now lady chain and my now lady charm That little kick the kick now lady charm We gon' get it in till we get it all gone So what you say, what you say, what you say Let's go Take it back to North Carolina for a second, hey I said I'm Juice Joe hey. And that's the twerk king She got a super booty up Woo. The same thing And she gon' twerk for you for me. She brought a homegirl jump. <laughs> New York City, we here. Each and every Wednesday night. <laughs> Ness, Johnny Stone, Dogs Below, Mike Major. You know what it is. <laughs> hey. 
Ness didn't want me to talk about Sin City last week. It was a movie. You know what it is. Crazy. <laughs> Check it. Here we go. Yo, I said I'm Juice Jones, and that's the twerk king. She got a super booty, yo. I said the same thing. If she gon' twerk for you, she gon' twerk for me. Slow down, press the brakes, twerk first, then what the juice say, back it up like juve. Come on, girl, work, work something for your boy. Come on, girl, work, work something for your boy. Told to drop down and touch your feet, raise up, bend your knees. Come on, just a little closer, girl, bring that ass. Let's go. Bring, bring that, that ass, ass to me. Bring that ass to me. Bring that ass to me. Bring that ass to me. Told to drop down and touch your feet, raise up, bend your knees. Come on, just a little closer, girl, bring that ass to me. Bring that ass to me. Hold up. Let me get on my street set for a second. You know what it is. We in the streets real heavy. Shout the fuck the world. What's up, though? Dope boy, I see. Face. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, let's go, baby. Yeah. We gonna switch lanes for a second, why not? Yeah. Hey, we said yeah, yeah. UBG. Mind over matter, that's real talk. Money over hoes, that's meal talk. Hundred million dollars, that's deal talk. Shout the boss lady, what's up, boss lady? Hey. See, I'm a G, you fraudulent. My flow's out of this world, no coordinates. Yeah, they're trying to show me out of orbit. But I'm living like the water in song. Let's go, hey. Diplomatic status, lawless. Tension, Shout the bad acting crazy. You be let's go. Love without hates, like life without fate, like crack without base. Yeah, hey. Wow. Jump in this race. I'm keep that this is- Shout to that boy Joe Bleezy. What up, Bleezy? Yeah. Hey, we say, yeah, he is. Hey, dope boy. Don't forget that live big, die enormous on that iTunes right now. Go get that, all right? Yeah. But after the show, though, hold up. All day a niggas trapped with serpents. Six feet deep, they won't even need to serve. Mohammed, what's up? My purpose is way worse. Yes. Born a star, I belong with Earth. True. Yeah. Far in orbit, away from the problems here. Yeah. Believe in myself, so it's only God I fear. Dollars here, so of course you know the llamas near. Touch one cent, don't be shedding tears for careers. I never interfere with anything but mine. What's mine? Everything above the flood. Yes. Yeah. You're looking for a hit like Granderson. I maneuver through the pressure. Katie Anderson. Let's go. Now watch me climb to the top. To my haters with this bottle of Ciroc Your boy's never gonna stop It's going down like Jack You gotta crawl before you walk So how you running Let's go I'ma keep climbing that ladder Listen Haters gonna talk all the time like yeah For your anniversary party Yeah, yeah Riverbank Grill, you know what it is To be old T on People that mind don't matter There's people that matter Yeah mind, so yeah Let's go, baby Yeah, yeah, yeah Shout out to my fourth quarter, boys, you know One eye in the air with a brown skin and fair, pretty women everywhere. With your ship in your hair and your sexy underwear. Would your love disappear if your friends want to share? Okay, my attitude and needs work. Anything besides sex, me first. You feel good, but your knees hurt. But you look great in my t-shirt. Let me put it all in reverse. I came from the bottom of the bottom, couldn't be worse. How you doing? Do it big like a rebirth. How you doing? Yeah. Fucking like a knee church, puffing on that green earth. I'm on that loud in the clouds, dream works. And everything is alright. Hit the club and make a hater have a long night. I'ma keep climbing that ladder. Gonna talk all the time. Hey, yeah. hey. Shout out to my girl Tara. She in the building tonight, baby. You know what it is. People that mind don't matter. There's people that matter don't mind. So yeah, yeah. Let's have some fun. Yeah. Haters 
Oh, I, said, I said it wrong? Yeah, yeah. What the fuck I said? This nigga. <laughs> yes. UEG Radio Live each and every Wednesday night. She says Sarah, not Tara. New York, hold up. Let's go. Let's go. Let me smooth it out for my ladies real quick. Yep. Mr. Wire was popping. Let's go. Hey. Let's go, ladies. Uh-huh. Mr. Y gave me a record for my debut album next March. Crazy, New York. You heard it? Crazy. Hold up. King me. King me. The throne is mine that I inherit. Uh-huh. Still, I feel like the king on the terrace. King me now. Now is the coordination. Dexterity in the boss the coordination. The pops have predicted my arrival. My disciples are buzzing through this recital. Yes. Paint yes. pictures with parables and Hill is sick with this audio elixir. Global warming, I'm the catalyst. Men are no longer savages or misogynists. Constellations are studied by astrologists. The bones are recovered by archaeologists. Politicians and haters are having out for me. Turn the black magic idol worship and out for me. They force to me to become a tyrant. Impatiently waiting, plus I'm defiant. Alliances is formed just to break them. Stay tuned, this is history. Let's go. Shout out to my girl Sarah. Like I said, she's in the building tonight, baby. New York City, what up, Dow? Oh, shit. Fire in my eyes. Enemies baptized. Hold up. A lot of bodies under my belt like King David. Lord in my veins, I run up as real sacred. Counts to a sand and do pain. Anger intensifies with my cadence. Traitors in among us, we bring death to. He's got NYPD in here. Oh, bodies with spikes. Oh, shit. And mortals fear for you. Face off. Yeah. Insubordinate, unlawful, like devotion. Uh-huh. Conquest the king, keep my hunger up. Killers wear smiles, so they sit close to us. I came in peace to bring some joy to them. But they came with a peace to put some hope through them. Nevertheless, I still reign supreme. We here. Teachers of mine are scattered throughout the team. Excellent, excellent. Amen. Let's go. The place for the most music variety. Music variety. Nightline Radio. Nightline Radio. Yeah, it's your neighborhood MC Don P. Rapping for music for days, Washington Heights and Dykeman. Saying y'all should keep it tuned on Untouchables Wednesdays, every Wednesday. Grind, nigga, this is what it looks like. Oh. Oh. Hey, Sarah's like, hey, come on. We keep it a gangsta. 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 Call me Joe. Hey. We keep it a gangsta. You keep it a gangsta. This nigga. Nah, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to another edition of UEG Ready Presents Untouchable Wednesdays. I am your favorite fat boy, Elliot Ness. To my right hand side is the most feared beard on the radio. Yep. And of course, fourth quarter boy, Mr. Mike Major. What up? The man? only one, Mr. Turn Me Up. What's up, brother? Feeling good, baby. I, I believe you. I believe sure. you. Play some new stuff, man. Talk about what you play today. Oh, man. man. Big shout out to the boy Juice Jones. He gave me that hot nigga freestyle. All right, shout out to the boy Forrest Nicholas. So we kind of had to read with that. Shout out to the boy Toast Delaney, of course, and OP. 
All right, they dropped a couple of uh, hot freestyles for that zero to 100. Shout out to the boy Drizzy Drake. Uh, what else we doing on there today? Shout out to my boy, uh, Mr. Y, who just rocked his record that kicked me. That's on that Death and Taxes, IamMikeMajor.com. Make sure you go get that but after the show. Yeah, All right. Boy. What else we rock today, man? Let me go to the library. Shout out to Fuck the World, too. Send me right. a nice little record. With the All most, right, called with, Like Yeah. With the most controversial battle rapper. Oh. In the city, Mr. Man. Math Hoffa, but we'll talk yeah. about that a little bit talk later. Talk about on. that another time. Yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, so big shout out to them. What else? Let me see what else is on my list today that we rocked out today. All right, shout out to the boy uh, Bathgate, too. That's my dude representing that Harlem NYC. All right, so that record was crazy, too. Um, see if I missed anybody. Now, I think we got a, got a couple of. We got it. My girl Sonya Blade got her record up next. You know, on the next break. <laughs> but right now, it's all about you, sweetheart. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Don't fix the screen. We're moving along. I know you guys are expecting Coney Brooks, but this is what we like to do. We like to mix it up a little bit and uh, talk about a lot of different endeavors and a lot of things that are going on. And one of the things we want to do is actually we want to introduce this young lady. But before we do, we have to put a program advisory, which is that UEG Radio may contain adult explicit language. Excuse me, sir. Sorry. No, I didn't mean to interrupt, but they said there's a bad echo on my there's microphone. Bad Fix echo that. on your microphone. Yo, did we just talk about this yes. before the show, man? Can we, the echo on his microphone. That means Can there's we, something that you did messing with the Ustream um, on, that's son. not working the way it should be working when it was working the way that it was working. What? <laughs> yeah. And he so, so did he. What? But like I said, UEG Radio may contain adult explicit language. Um, not suitable for anyone under the age of 18. So please, if you are 18, log off right now or ask for your parents' permission. Including my son, who's looking at me from the other side of the screen. You look crazy. He is crazy. Uh, but with that, being, <laughs> with that being said, want to introduce a young lady by the name of Miss Sarah Sanford. Did I get that correctly? Yes, he did. Yeah, because apparently I fucked it up. Sarah, right? It's the music. It was the music. It was the music. It was the music. So my bad, Sarah. And uh, this okay. young lady is uh, our newest addition to Nightline Radio. As I want to say, just events coordinator, but this is like special projects. Um, undercover cop. Oh. Um, you know, <laughs> just because a lot of us need some assistance from time to time. I'm not going to mention any names. You would you say that? But things happen. I don't know. <laughs> um, so she's here to keep things in line. Uh, and with that being said, again, we're going to let her introduce herself and uh, kind of talk a little bit about what she does here tonight. Before we do that, I'm sorry, because I want to make sure we get this right. They said there's a bad echo on everybody. On everyone. What I want to make sure we correct it before we let Sarah talk check. about what she does for Nightline Radio. I don't know about the undercover cop situation, but, uh, <laughs> you know, a couple of security guards in here, a couple of people who work, work that night line shift, that, yeah. that, that black and, that black on black grind situation. I mean, but we don't, we don't really get out of control, you know, we behave. Ness. Think, okay. I've like known it. you for three years. Like let's it. not do this. <laughs> on radio? Really? No, I'm chilling. Okay. Um, so let's try that once again. Young lady, please introduce yourself and let us know what you're about. Um, well, I'm Sarah Sanford, like you said, and I've been kind of lurking around Nightline for a couple of years now. So, lurking, lurking you know. Years? A couple of years, yeah. I pop in and out for the Stalker. last two years. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out where I was. I was a groupie. I was a groupie. Stalker. I was a Nightline groupie, yeah. So, it's official now. I'm here in New York, so... Um, I'm part of Nightline. Got asked to be on board the team. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I'll be uh, overseeing event coordination and also helping with all the um, community outreach events that Nightline um, organizes and helps promote. So I'll kind of keep that in order. And also uh, planning to put together a promotion team of girls to kind of nice. rep Nightline out in the I community like and clubs and special events. So oh. stay tuned for that coming up mm -hmm. soon. Okay, Sarah, let me, yeah. before you go on, <laughs> because you've been lurking, but in lurking, <laughs> in lurking, lurking means you've been around, yeah. but you haven't been involved. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Let me, let me help you out with some of the wording that you use. When you say girls, and then you say uh. rub out, we're thinking a different kind of situation. <laughs> you got to make sure you're clear. <laughs> I'm just saying, not me, but for others. Well, <laughs> for everyone. She for said, help the, she said, we're going to get a team of girls help rub out. No, I know. That's not what I said. Do we help is out? Is it like DVR? Can we rewind what she said? Help you out. You said help out. Help out. You didn't say rub out. Not rub. Why would I even put rub in that sentence? Stuff. I gotta go. I, gotta I think go. you were hoping I said rub. 
Wait a minute. Look, as, as, what, as the porn music is playing let's, in the let's keep moving. <laughs> I think you were hoping. It's okay. I'm you, sorry. You can hope. I'm sorry, Sarah. I, I won't take the hope away from you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, so was you were saying. So anyway, yeah. So that's what I'm bringing to Nightline um, right now and see what else unfolds. Also, um, hoping to have a show. Nice. Come on yeah. board. You have the voice. You have the voice. We yes. Have thank you. La, la, la. Okay. The voice was the speaking, <laughs> not the singing. <laughs> <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> I tried. And we give you an equal effort. Thank you. Yes. I'll take that. So as far as the show, what would, what you, what would the show be? What would we be typing? What would be some of the topics? What would be kind of the structure, if we could? Not that we want to take anything from you. We just want to give the world a, uh, a sample so that they, maybe they want to, you know, taste it. And, and, you know, <laughs> up to them a little day. sample, a little sample. Um, well, basically, um, it's going to be patterned after my business, Nouveau Arts. Okay. And what I do is provide coaching through the arts. And I have two divisions. I do um, basically a lot of uh, training as far as like dance and music and theater is concerned. And then I also have a fashion division as well where I'm gonna be coaching um, women primarily on how to develop their image, their style. See? You see looked at you. See she did? <laughs> <laughs> Give me a bell. Because you see she did that, that, right? Woman? Right, she said women and looked at me. Now if I just said something out of wrong. I'm glad you caught it. I'm making sure you stay in line now. <laughs> oh. oh <man. laughs> Ness, speaking um, of, hold up. I don't know if you should have played that song. I'm not playing anything. How about that? Because I was told, and Sarah, I have to let you hear this, and I didn't mean to be rude and interrupt, but no, it's okay. when he threw on a raining man or a bat threw it on, we did an event three weeks ago at Besso Lounge. And because oh. Ness is my man, because he's my man, I chose not to do this. One of the cooks said, yo, do me a favor. He said, throw on Rain and Men. That's Ness' favorite song. I swear. <laughs> you probably know who said it. So, and I was like, no, nah, I can't do that to my man. Don't do that. Real quick. OK, stop it. Back. So, Calm this, down this, over there. This is what happened, right? Give me the damn thing. So on Saturdays, usually, Mike Major's playing, uh, Mike Major, uh, Mike Touch. Right. He's playing, you know, LP DJ, cool dude. He plays, you know, his music, he rocks out. Um, and then he has a mix that he throws on for everybody to leave. And then about, I want to say about two months ago, he decides on a, a very uh, intoxicated evening, Ness, I'm going to play your favorite song. Only because I kept on requesting a song from Rick Ross. Okay. So he had played it first and then cut it off. So I said, do me a favor. Can you just, and I said it in front of everyone, which was the worst part about it. Can you do me a favor and just play my song? I've been asking you, you cut it off, play my song. So he makes an announcement out of it. You know, and says, you know, blah, blah, blah. And this is Ness's favorite song. He's back for it all night. And then sure enough. Wow. <laughs> so now every other week or so. Right. This song is being played. Because I, I heard it and I was like, I was like, that can't be his favorite song. Yeah. You know what's funny? I didn't even see her. Like, excuse me, Miss Thing. She on the side hustling <laughs> over there. <laughs> How you doing? She is away. We're already from promoting you guys. Oh, nice, <laughs> I love it. At DJ Mike. I Mike come with my Arena. own, my own promotion. <laughs> at team. UEG Radio. Come with my own promotion team. I see that. I see that. I see. That. I love we, it. We kind of do the same thing, but we don't. We talk about that later. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so that's that's how that happened. So now Cisco, who's the chef over at Best Lounge, shout out to Cisco. Um, if you want to try some of that food, it's amazing. Look True at story. Man is smiling right here. Three twenty East Two Four Street. Small plug. Um, so now that's that's the joke now. So whenever there's another DJ that's not my touch, I, I still got to hear that song for whatever. Nah, I wasn't gonna do that to you, you my man. No, I was, can't but, uh, do that to you. It happens. It happens. Please don't play another one of these drops, Danny. Yo. Um, hey, hey, so I, I have a question. As far as the show goes, what is the timeline more or less that you're thinking about making this happen? Um, well, I'm not sure yet. We're still in talks for all of that because there's actually a live component that I wanna have footage on going out to the clubs. Looking at the ladies who Ooh. actually are classy and sexy. I want to stop you right there. Empowering them. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, absolutely. In the Bronx. Yes, it's definitely needed, especially in the Bronx. I'm hanging with her. I, I, me personally. <laughs> I'm hanging with her. Wait, I want no, my wait, brother. Wait. I want my brother. Me to speak personally. About this. I think a lot of people want. <laughs> I just. I, mm -hmm. 
We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Notice we made the same expression without even talking about we'll it. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, it's a matter of like calling out the girls that are out there that are doing it right, you know, right. because today ratchet seems to be like the trend and it's not cute. Wow. Thank you. It's not. I really applaud. Shots no, because he has to fired. say that. It's not cute. So my goal is to go out there and promote all the women who are keeping it classy and sexy and empowering oh. them to continue to do that and switching the role model from the ratchet to keeping it like classy because that's I really where it's at. Already. Yeah, man. that ratchet TV yeah. and all the other stuff that got you, got you people confused, especially the way television confuses people who who don't have their own brain cells. Brainwashes, brainwashes. Yeah, they absolutely. Does. Cause you know that's not what we want to represent as women, and then we're the first one to turn around and say, "Oh, he treated me like a dog. He treated me like this. He treated me like." This. But so good at the fifth right now. No, you listen, know. I'm, I'm gonna agree with her because rat because if you really pay attention to it, most of the ratchet shows that people get into, like right, five it's all it's all geared, in my opinion, it's all geared towards like it's really negative if you really think about it. It portrays minorities in a terrible light. Like all we are about is drama and all the, the sassiness and the head shaking. That's we represent more than that. We do, we do, but oh, but if you yeah, watch yeah. TV, it doesn't make us look like we represent more than that. You know what? I, I kind of feel like sometimes those shows are your your hidden person who you want to be but you're scared to be. So you end up looking at these shows because then you know you're kind of living through these shows. That's just my personal opinion. But I've been saying this for a while, especially with VH1 shows that just really have us looking really really bad. Yo, it really does. Like everybody, you know. it seems like you know what's funny because. There is so much content, content not on TV Agreed. that it's so easy for us to search for entertainment, quote unquote, right? So we fall victim to whatever VH1 and MTV and these other shows put on. But at the end of the day, like that's that's really like, like I said, if you take if you really think about it, you'll never see a Jay Z do one of these reality shows. Nope. You won't see Kanye. You won't see Beyonce. Yes, no, whoa, 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 whoa. no, I'm going to pay attention. Go back. The only reason why you see Kanye is because of Kim. Hey, but he's but listen, he will never have his own show. Understand what I'm saying? He won't. He won't. Believe me, he won't. As, he much, won't. as controversial as but Kanye still- is, he's intelligent enough to understand what this, what this media frenzy to some extent is all about does punch paparazzi in the face so i mean it, it, it's a give and take with him you know you got to take what you but can. he's not going to create a whole 10 series no, 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 show out of it no, though no, no. yeah yeah he's that's not. the difference you know it, he's not they take people who used to be somebody your scrappies of the world right they take all of these people who they know are broke let's keep it real right your young jocks who they know are broke who they know need a check who need that you know Need that that line like that quick fifteen yeah, minutes, boy. and they give them a show. And guess what? If you used to be, if you're used to being in that limelight, this is the perfect setup for you. And they're giving you a check. You're not gonna turn that down. True, I agree. I agree. But I, I would love to see what she has. If you press one more button. Um, I would love to see what she has played out as far as the, what that would look like. I, I'm a visual person, so I need to like I hear it. It makes sense. Sounds like a great idea. But I actually need to see it. Just because you're talking about doing this in the Bronx. And you have a format that will <laughs> create <laughs> Buzz. from what I see and what you're talking about doing the top rated radio show in the city because the amount of tomfoolery that happens at these lounges, <laughs> especially in our borough, shout Absolutely. out to the Bronx. I'm from the Bronx, Absolutely. but you will see some things. Absolutely. And I want to see, and I, I'm telling you, he is Yo, man, crazy right now. What are you now. doing? Um, it, it's going to be an interesting. It's going to be an interesting show. Just yeah. from what you say, it's going to be an interesting show. Well, you know, it's Empower Hour. That's what I'm going to call it. And just Our try to get, um, you know, girls to really look at themselves differently and really have that conversation in the mirror because obviously their friends are not having it with them. So it's about giving them the tools so sure. that they can have that conversation with themselves so they walk out the door looking the way they should be representing themselves. Nice. Okay. Be careful with the Power Hour. So basically, Empower. 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 Okay. Empower oh, wow. Hour. <laughs> um, that was the voice from within. Um, so basically, what you're trying to say, just to kind of trying to get an example of your show. So, let's say someone showed up with Chinese slippers, spandex, a uh, bomb beanie tube top, 
and forgot to do their hair, so they gelled the shit out of it before they went out that <laughs> night. Um, what would be your conversation with that female? I would not have a conversation with that female. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having conversations with the ones who got it right, not okay. the ones who got it okay. wrong. Sounds good. Right? Sounds good. It's about good. promoting the right thing and not highlighting the wrong, Before which around. is going back to yeah. what you've positive, been saying positive. that's happening on TV, right? We're highlighting all the crazy nonsense that goes on in society. And what about all the good stuff it's, that we're it's, doing? It's not even, it's, and to expand on what, what Sarah's saying, it's not even just reality TV. I posted something about this maybe two months ago on Facebook, right? There's so many people that are doing good things in the world, right? You have people who, you know, school just started back up. Shout out to all the kids who, who are back in school, kids who are who start in their freshman year, college and all of that. We have so many people who are 30, 35 years old who are smart enough, who are brave enough to go back into the college life, get a degree, right? They'll post about it. No one talks about it. Of course not. Put something about somebody beating somebody's ass on World Star. Everybody shares it on of Facebook. Course. Of course, of course. Because, that's, you know, because you know this why? is what we do. Because no, this course. is all. But part it's of conditioning. It's that's conditioning. It's conditioning. Right? We're, we've been conditioned to support that. Right? So if we also get in the mindset of like praising and supporting. Eventually, that stuff is going to switch, right? It's going to die off. It's the same thing, like, now all of a sudden, to look like a nerd is, like, the cool thing. Where, like, 10 years ago, people were like, why are you dressing like that? You look crazy, right? But now, because you want to look smart, it's a cool thing. Right. It's about conditioning. It's about changing the mindset. And that's exactly what I'm all about. And that's what my coaching practice is for, for breaking through those barriers and really trying to be the person you want to be, regardless of what society is telling you to okay, do. So I'm going to have a quick... Um funny moment with you because we were talking about using certain words um can you explain conditioning because in my house being that i have four <laughs> boys the word conditioning means something totally different um so conditioning I, yeah. <laughs> conditioning meaning that you're being trained by the media and society to like respond to certain things that are portrayed in front of you right change so your mindset if, right so if you're constantly being shown like you know ghetto craziness and people acting wild and that's what people are like all talking about and there's hype around that then you're going to be conditioned to like support that agree Agreed. the crazy part for me though is that like like you said you mentioned um you mentioned it between the interaction and that's what sells i can agree to some extent but the problem is who's doing the selling i'm talking about there are people who are taking these world star links they will copy and paste it to their Facebook page. Mm -hmm. This person then shares it. That person then shares it. That person then shares it. Then shares it in the group. Then shares it in another group. And it's all negative. But like I said, let somebody go ahead and get their bachelor's degree. No one's going to share that. You'll be lucky if you get five likes on that. Well, the problem is this how it's presented, right? Because it's not just about getting the degree. It's about what, what was the story. You know, did this woman come from being homeless on the street and now she got a bachelor's degree? That's where the story is. That's where the that's what's going to motivate people to want to like look at it and be like, wow, that inspired me. You, you know, know because what? it's not just about you know getting what? a bachelor's degree. It, it makes, I agree it, it with you. It makes sense to some extent, but some people will look at that as a gimmick. As That's the reason. The only reason that's going to be shared is because it has to have a certain sad moment in life or some epic fail in order for it to be important. Well, I mean, it's about touching, moving, and inspiring people. And, and whatever it's going to take to make that happen is what's, what's key, right? In a positive sense. Right. What we're doing is the opposite, right? We're not, we're not trying to touch, move, or inspire anybody. We're just highlighting everybody's failures. Okay. So I'm how good. are you inspiring that? You're mm -hmm. not. I'm or good. anyone. I agree. Hold on. Clap for that. Thank you. Um, <laughs> and it's true because you remember, the, I, I personally right now cannot remember the life of me. The uh, the young man who was accepted to like all of the Ivy League schools from the Bronx, um, and a lot of people at first oh, were like right, right, right. applauding and praising him, but then it was almost like it was almost doing it like to see if it was really like if it was real, basically. That's when the, the sharing and the posting of that came out. Um, so I, I can relate to, to what you're saying to that effect. Um, but give us your social media information. Give us your email if you want people reaching out to you. Yes, definitely. Like that. Yeah, I'm actually offering some free coaching sessions, 30-minute sessions for ladies out there who are interested in trying to like uncover some some barriers that may be blocking them from their future goals or careers. And so they can just email me at nouvelarts at gmail. And it's N-U-V-O, V as in Victor, O. Like the drink? 
like the drink arts sorry a-r-t-s at gmail.com this is where we go wrong <laughs> <laughs> yes God. like the drink like nouveau tv yes nouveau arts Okay, okay. Nice. Well, we thank you. We appreciate you coming through. Um, one word or, or phrase of inspiration for anyone that's listening right now. Um, or maybe your own personal slogan. I don't know about a personal slogan <laughs> per se. <laughs> <laughs> but I definitely could tell people, like, it's not about what everybody's doing. You know, it's about what you got to do and what you feel is right. And it's, 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 it takes a special person to, like, really go out there in the world and know that you can be who you want and you can express yourself how you feel is right and not to let any obstacle anyone any any influence even if it's your parents like you got to do what you want to do and you can make it it's up to you because you're your own you're really your own enemy it's not about everybody else i agree i agree all right love well you're not going anywhere just yet yeah but we want to thank you Kidnapped. for sharing that with us no problem. um and then we're kind of get into account of what we do on a regular basis so but before we do that there's one thing that's very important that we did not do which is shout out everybody in the chat oh let's do that we little we 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 chilling right now let me see who's in here all right so big shout big shout to uh boss leona all right shout to her shout to cindy ueg ladies of course shout to my girl lady g representing that 206 out there in cleveland ohio what's up we got a surprise for y'all to end this ball. Okay. Ooh, Ooh, boy. Karma Delane, I hope you're listening. Toe Boy, what up? Fuck the world. I see you. Shout out to my girl Snooky, of course. Boss Lady and the one anonymous user in the chat room. Of course, we invite each and every person every week to create your profile, upload your picture so we can shout you out. Barack with Nightline Radio and UEG. Definitely, definitely. Coney Brooks is in the building, um, so expect him shortly after the music break. Work um, with it. One of the topics I wanted to talk about today was everybody's always talking about business. Everybody's always talking about um, the thing that I see now, everybody posting on, on whether it's Facebook or any form of social media is, you know, business inquiries, serious business inquiries only. You know what I mean? Like everyone, now all of a sudden it's all about if it's not serious, if it is serious. What, what is business? What is the definition of business to, to everyone in the room right here? When you think about the word business, what, what does it mean? For me personally as a DJ, and it's speaking of Ness as my manager, of course, so I can speak to it on a few levels. Like if, if, if Ness puts out something for me and says serious business inquiries, we, we're talking about something that's gonna be, talking about positivity. Moving forward, we're talking about making sure that that money is correct. We're not going to fake the funk and keep it. We're going to keep it real right here on UEG. Mm -hmm. Making sure that that money is right. Making sure that the entire situation is right. Make sure that your presentation in your conversation is correct. That's most important. Like we were talking about serious inquiries only. It's amazing how people, whether they post or whether they converse, not conversate. Good right? job. Whether they converse, <laughs> that they don't understand how to speak intelligently when having a business-like conversation. And so they don't understand why people don't take them seriously. Even on our social media uh, pages, whether it be your Facebook, your Twitter, your LinkedIn, your IGs, what have you, people don't realize that everything that you post, everything that you say, your presentation, your, your wording, everything depends on how that conversation goes when we're talking business. So if you're somebody who can't speak properly, who can't write properly, Looks bad. Hard for people to want to really have true business interactions with you. Agreed. So the people take their, their, you know, we, we all post jokes and, and all these different things, but when you're promoting your business, like if I promote my mixtape, or I promote UEG Radio, I promote Fourth Quarter Boys, whatever it is that I promote, you've got to make sure that that presentation is, is got to make sure it represents what you wanted to say. Agree. Okay. So, I mean, that's Agreed. what it is for me, just Agreed. making sure presentation, everything is correct. Yeah, business, well, bro. business to me, I mean, Definitely got a dedication, man. You know, you, you want somebody that's gonna that's gonna be there. You got a lot of people that uh, say, you know what, I'm with it, and then just just disappear. Yeah, what happened, man? Okay. All this, that, you know, and it can't be all about. Be honest, the business can't be all about the money, man. Because mm -hmm. fortunately, mm -hmm. you know, a lot of businesses at the beginning don't, you know, yeah, they don't do nothing. You gotta start somewhere. Yeah. So. Okay. Okay. But I would say though, before before we get into that, I would I would agree with you because there's things that I've done for free. There's there's things that I've done, you know, for for somebody as a favor because because we all were at that place where we started up first. But still, even with it being a, a free situation, your presentation still has to be what it is. Oh, of course. It still has to be there, and and, and people feel like sometimes because it's it's free or because it really 
may not be, you know, a financial gain or benefit that that should hinder your your, your presentation, and it shouldn't. You know, it's just like I heard a DJ tell me on my Facebook, and I looked at him like he's crazy. He said to me that when he plays at a party or a venue for free, that he agreed to. Because at the end of the day, let's keep it a buck. No one makes you do anything for free. Mm -hmm. They may present it because that's what their pockets say or don't say. But if you agree, then you agree to do the job. And he said to me that when I do a party or an event for free, I don't play the same as if I was getting paid. So naturally, I looked at him and I said, you're crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. You're crazy. Because you're not taking care of your craft. Absolutely. Like, there isn't an immediate, there isn't a show to show financial benefit for everyone here at UEG. But we use this as a platform to create opportunities for ourselves. Exposure, other gigs. There's, there's mixtapes that I've hosted based on this show, which is a financial gain down the road. So you can't look at that and say, well, you know what? I'm not getting paid for the show. Let me just play how yeah. you want to play. That's yeah. crazy. Agree, agree. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're basically talking about being professional. You know, you can't say that ding ding ding. You're going out there and being a business person and you don't know how to be professional. And it goes again <laughs> with your brand. You know, everything you're saying is your brand. So like what are you what are you looking like? What are you talking like? What are your services? What what is the breakdown and how are you, what's your integrity piece to that? You know, how much are you holding that accountable to yourself? Because that's what's really going to speak volumes. People know, oh, Sarah's going to throw an event. People already know. They have an expectation of what it's going to be like. Because I have, I'm have, i backing up what I'm saying based on what I said I was going to do. Say X, do X. You know, you can't, you can't go out there and be like, yeah, I do this and I do that. And then, you know, like you're saying, they don't show up. They're late. It's half-assed. You know, they don't got their stuff together. They don't have all the pieces in place. You know, that's not being professional. I agree. And, and she used the word integrity, which is a big word when you talk about presenting a brand and taking care of something that you're trying to build. Uh, but with that being said, it's about 8.56 right now. We're about to get into a quick music break. Coney Brooks is in the building. Sarah, we thank you for coming through. Before Appreciate you go, it. though, before yes, you go. Yes, ma'am. Only because you walked right into it. I got to say this real quick. September 6th um, at Skyline Lounge, we're having a networking event. So for those of you who are professionals... Well, and have that's business. The, that's the airplane place, right? Yeah, yeah. it's the airplane yeah. place. Yeah. Yeah. Come out. We're going to have a networking event. Mm. Bring your business cards and um, yeah, your business popping. <laughs> oh, don't okay. even say that's another conversation. Yeah, that's a whole <laughs> different time. We'll different probably get into that after the music break. How about that? <laughs> um, but thank you, love. We'll definitely put it out. Send us all the information so we know exactly what to say and how to put it out there for you. Um, and we thank you for coming through, as well as the uh, anonymous voice on the side. <laughs> thank you, love. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Mike Major. I, I didn't get her name. Wait, what's your name, sweetheart? Jeanette Villafane. Jeanette? Villafane. Villafane. There we go. Said, she said that with an expression, in case you didn't know. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm not messing with him right now. UEG Radio, we live each and every Wednesday night, of course. We have Jeanette Villafane in the building. <laughs> All right, shout out to my girl Sarah. We here. Let's do it. UEG style, baby. Let's go. Shout out to my girl Sonya Blaze. She represents that Brooklyn borough. You know what it is. For want to live for the moment. Having a dream and living like our own. Crazy. Yeah, being broke, I'm condoning. Any who oppose, I treat them like opponents. Yeah, am I wrong for progress? Uh. And being too hood will thank the projects. Blade. That song been on five seconds. They like, that's good, Sonya. Dudes, what you thought. Hold up. Shout out to my girl Sonya Blaze. Like I said, she represents that Brooklyn she will be on my debut album drop in spring 2015. This is Am I Wrong? This is the remix right here. For want to live for the moment, having a dream and living like I own it. Yeah, being broke, I'm condoning. Any who oppose, I treat them like opponents. Yeah, am I wrong for progress? And being too hood, well, thank the project. Let's go. Late, G2, New York. I rep BK, my dudes, what you thought? Sneaks, fresh polo socks. No silicone, no Photoshop. I been no low, hey, y'all look got. A style of my own, nice photo oh, my rock, rock. Sure. No stopping up. And I ain't famous, but I'm popular. Uh -huh. I roll to the top, a longer drive, and I climb hills, only strong survive. Ain't nobody like us. Won't change, they better. Let's go, Sonya. Cause hard work is a must, and I got my own shit. That machine is a plus. Trust, still hard to resist. 
They was act like I ain't exist, but I'll never give up. So they gon' learn. Nico, tell them it's your turn. I ain't trying to do what everybody else do. Let's go. Just cause everybody like I said, this is that I am. Am I wrong? Hold on. If one thing am I wrong? Sonya Blade. Let's go. Don't forget my four year anniversary party next Friday night. Let's go. Shout out to my girl Kaisha. What's up, mama? Hey. Let's go. She said, nigga, you need a haircut. <laughs> Let's go. Yes. True to myself, it's uplifting. I'm in a position to change the rules when lane shifting. Oh, and y'all forgetting. I'ma be on top of the world. That's what I told y'all. Everywhere I go, let's go. No secret, man. I speak with fans. I hustle smart and I meet the mans. I seen it all through my rape bands. American graffiti spray cans. Yep. I hold my own, unlike the rest. Yep. Expect the worst, but hope for the best. They play with checkers, I move with chess. I get high scores when life's a test. So, am I wrong to claim? I never sell my soul for fame. Am yep, I out let's my go. Mind when I try to find why my results don't match my grind, I'm not defined by names or lines. No clicks or rhymes or a place of time. Just stay the course and throw a peace sign to being real. Let's go to y'all. Yep. That boy Coney Brooks in the building. What's up, though? Yes, sir. Once again, big shout out to my girl Sonya Blade representing that Brooklyn. What's up, Brooklyn? Canarsie, Red Hook, let's go. Bed style, what up though? Do or die. Hey, hey. Follow me on that Twitter and that Instagram, baby, at DJ Mike Major. You know. Let's have some fun to y'all. Right, right. If you tell me I'm wrong, wrong, I don't want to be right. If you tell me I'm wrong, wrong, I don't want to be right, right. Let's go. Something different in New York City. Right. Sonya Blade, Brooklyn, what's up now? For trying to reach the things that I can't see. Nightlineradio.com, let's do it. Boss Lady, what up now? Hold up. Let's go. I'm back on my street shit for a second. Let's go, baby. Shout to my brother, Jay Universal. What's up, though? He will also be on my debut album, Spring 2015. Let's go. I don't stop. Neck Rocky, make Apollo drop. I'm a pretty boy, Floyd, but I don't box. Flow leaking like a hollow shot on a Puerto Rican, the Minicano block. I'm the head honcho with combo shots from the same spot, made Billy Blanco. I go hard till I blow large. 16 bars full of battle scars. Pop that trunk into what you want. I got bricks, I got pounds of that, oh my god. And I owe the odds. Fuck them, don't tuck a hoe. Why old niggas with the guns that blow? Roll with me, keep the hoes in my bones. Let's go. Get off parole. I'ma get cash like Ross Perot. All I need is ass and some awesome drove. Even though it'll all seem impossible. Uh -huh. Then I'm out, nigga, rock and roll. If it's hot, then it's hot, nigga. I should know. Make the whole drop low like a 06 fold. Throw your middle finger up and my closet show. Let's go, baby. We call this record right here amazing. Let's go, New York City. Let's go. Each and every Wednesday night, you know what we do. Yeah. Four-year anniversary party next Friday, New York. And I'm like right, and I'm like twice. I might be some that I 
I might like. If you're like Tina, then I'm like Ike in a tight white beater with fresh Let's go. Louis threads, Gucci stripes, movie life, goofy fights. And I don't know why, cause I don't need them. If I don't own shit, then the boy GM. My style, pack out, Mayweather knockout. Get your girl wet way before I pull a cock out. Jeeps on D's, ears on freeze. Funeral flow, put the tears on me. Put the tears on me. Black on krills, drops on wheels, bottles on chill. Perfect set rap, baby, how do you feel? On my red cafe shit, I'm so ill. Let's go. You better than I. Get hook, brain, hook, cheddar, then slide. Who get kicked like Edmund? I give a bad bitch that Eminem. Uh. So relax and relax while I do the big pump. Pack a Mac in the act. It's a new addiction. Tap that ass in the back while I blow your bitch. UEG is me. Hey. 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 Saturday, September 27th, our Bella's Lounge, New York City. I'm there. Yep. Private event, September 20th. You know what it is, New York City, Brooklyn. Get ready. Hold up. Shit, huh? Yep. Shout to my brother, Mr. Shaw Shanks. What up, though? Shout to my sis, Go Getter. <laughs> we call this record feature presentation. Ooh. Movie style. You know what I do? Not a movie, no. nigga. This is real life. No squares in my circle. All my niggas real right. Real, real right. Keep calm. Trust me, this could be a chill it night. Could. But he's a hungry dog. And he will yeah. Cause it's survival of the fittest That's the real That's fight the real Don't get caught fight. slipping niggas Hitting off of pedal bikes <laughs> They try to say All I talk about is hood shit oh. While these frontin' rappers Talking all this good shit hey. There's no H on my belt But keep something hot Doing like a dub on the belt <laughs> While I'm blowing pot Get the fuck out the way Yo, why that nigga driving so slow? Oh. I flow till you get my drift My heart cold December 5th yeah. Be rolling and blowing piss Got them haters mad they sick Brooklyn is my residence Attitude so evident I take that and move with it To places they never win Let's go What's up? UEG Radio, Nightline Radio, Jack Com Cody Brooks, he's here Wednesday night, you know what we do Turn up, why not? Yeah. Shout to that boy Shanks too. What's up? All my Brooklyn niggas, what up Damn, though? That's it, nigga. I don't fuck with these bitch niggas. I know you seen my queen, nigga. What the fuck are one with your bitch, nigga? We make hits, nigga. Mob shit. That cocaine, that hard shit. Y'all fuck around and try to ride with us, and y'all fuck around and get caught. Let's go. Get tossed off that bridge, boy. I'm from Brooklyn, I don't play that shit. It's shot town or get down. You got a problem, boy, then say that shit. Got problem, Shanks, got a problem, me. Got problem, me, you got a problem with us. And if you ain't got my money, nigga. It sounds like you got a problem. <laughs> I'm off the leash, I'm off the chain. Shake, said, go get him, boy. And if I got a problem with a nigga, I'ma get him And I hope you pussy niggas ain't with him, boy Cause a nigga right here really with it, boy It's shot town to the death of me I wish y'all niggas would step to me None of y'all niggas could F with me I said, whoa, Kim Asabi This is not a hobby This music is my life, man I body anybody, I'm on anybody track On my birthday, I said that And ain't nobody answer back And if you do, I'll body that Dead, oh yeah Macho oh, man, baby. Baby, nigga <laughs> Nigga said macho man status, hold up Yep. Shout out to that boy Joker the Bully. What's up? The whole TMG. Handsome H, welcome back, my nigga. What up? We call this record right here, This Real Life. Rest BX, what's up, though? TK, I see you, huh? Here we go. This real life, niggas act up and get clapped up right in his own hood. His man's cake. Cody Brooks face, though. Life. Oh, shit. All of my goons, 730, where you break night. If you want to eat, nigga, early. This real life. Can't trust nobody. Yeah. Friends be the ones coming at you with the shot. This real life. You hate Hold up. Hold up. Get it twisted. It's far from a movie. This Yo, listen. Joker the bully, listen. My nigga Coney Brooks face is crazy though. Like I said, Coney Brooks in the building. You know what it is, New York. But first, let's rock with my man Joker the bully. What up though? Hey. TMG, what up? John Burgundy. I see you, my nigga. Trust nobody, best friends be the ones coming at you with the 
the shot it. It's real life, you hate it cause I'm shining like jewelry. But don't get it twisted, it's false. TMG, it's real life. From the Bronx, motherfucker, this is where it's at. The perfect hip hop, so I'm about to bring it back. They say in New York fell off, but never that. Slinging dope, slinging coke, slinging hella crack. Flow sick like the crack flow in the 80s. I'm from the era where dope fiends would sell their babies. Every night a mother cries due to homicide. That's why a nigga like me want a better life. Nice crib, nice whip for the kids and wife. In the hood, I made it to a rare age. Didn't want my mama see me on the front page. I was forced to learn all this shit the hard way. But hard work in the real trap crime pays. Didn't half ass nothing, had to really hustle. Posted on the block, couple shooters for the muscle. Young niggas that'll plug you with nothing else. That's real life. Niggas act up and get clapped up right in his own hood. Let me get one more now. This real life. Yeah. Once again, big shout to the boy Joker the Bully. What's up? Yeah. Hey. What we said, Joker? This real life, huh? This real life. Coney Brooks, that beat kind of crazy, though. I'm from the city where niggas know what time it is. From a distance, that's the only way they talk the shit. You gotta be on point with the safety off the grip. In a New York minute, niggas is getting hit. Yeah. Grind hard from an A to a full key. You need some roll. Send the UEG ladies, what's up, though? That's the only way you stand will ever build a pause. I'm from the Bronx, all my hustlers and real thugs. What y'all know about weak straight, no shower. Cause the block is clicking fiends coming at all hours. More respect, and of course comes the fucking power. But that's irrelevant. TMG, the world is ours. Like I said, big shout to the boy Joker, the bully, the whole TMG. Rest BX, handsome age, welcome back, my nigga. Let's go. Cali RP, what's up? French Montana. Some Coke boys, what up? Yeah! Break moves when I'm making my moves, I can't lose. Cause I'm leaving them hot and cold too. Like Tony Brooks, don't make that face. I heard work with it though, my nigga. Woo hoo! I can't wait to play that record though. Oh God. Yeah. This is crazy, man. Shout out to my brother, Dogs Malone. What's up, Dogs? Let's go. Hey. It's the ninth inning. It's the ninth inning. Let's go. Coke boys. French Montana. Ah. Don't be mad, your career's in the knife in it. Uh, I'm in the drop head being slight tenant. Uh, Big boy truck, your bitch getting piped in it. Uh, VS1's on my neck, niggas ice. Let's go. Why sell belt with the strap in it? Montana got the real niggas back winning. Woo. New money come with some new house. Get my nut and I'm ghost like that new rose. Uh. Got the blueprint, no loopholes. Loophole. Your new deal come buy me new clothes. <laughs> Me and Don P on the grind out. Go. Whip sitting low, gotta climb Can't out. Come in, you on your way out. But like you fucking with Diddy, there ain't no way out. Close the door, twist the lock, nigga. You just can't leave. Headlock, apply pressure, nigga. You just can't breathe. Game move. Careers a rap, but don't trip. I'm on street money, this rap's a little flip. I'm on Wall Street, honey, so watch my stock tip. We outside trading, you want this whole brick? As a young youth, I used to flip on bastards. Now that I'm mature, I just give out caskets. At last, is a dawn built harder than Teflon. My niggas feel cold, or you faggots are stepping. On. They flame gone, yep. they still trying to get it back nah. They ain't spitting fire, too gassed and no match We hooked on winning, smoked the competition yep. We up 10-1, bottom of the ninth inning
Welcome back. UEG Radio presents Untouchable Wednesdays only on NightlineRadio.com. My major's feeling some type of way. He's going from heat to heat to heat to heat to heat. And by the way, may I say it's all unsigned, just in case you just Word. tuned in. Uh, but Coney Brooks is in the building. Yeah. Let's let's we are rocking let's out with the brother. I got to say know. before we go on, fix your face. Man. <laughs> yeah, he was, he was rocking like, yo. Yeah, he's playing that fire. Yo, listen, all independent artists only is what we do, UEG Radio. You know what I mean? We're glad to have you up here, though. Of course. It's an honor. It's an honor. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Uh, real quick, shout out to our brother, Dogs Malone, who's handling us some personal business. Yes, um, yes. He should be coming in a little bit later, maybe. Uh, if not, then, you know, of course, you'll see him every here. Every, uh-oh, somebody's calling. Every single Wednesday, 8 to 10. Um, we also have to shout out our sponsors. Shout out to Soda Pop Apparel. Check out the website, www.sodapop.com. Tees.com. There is a special going on right now, so log on. Make sure you take advantage of that as well. Check out www.themafiagroup.com. That is our official uh, magazine, our sponsor, Mafia Magazine. Shout out to Gordon Gray and the whole fam over there. Uh, but right now, it's about the interview. It's about Coney Brooks. My brother, how you been? Working. I, I, you ain't lying about that. <laughs> you definitely ain't lying about that, man. Uh, Working. Talk to us about uh, the weather, life. Personally, what's going on with you right now? What, how you, how you been doing? Oh man, I'm, I'm blessed, man. Um, we just dropped the album, you know, top of the summer, doing some great numbers, some crazy numbers with that. You know what I'm saying, um, getting an opportunity this month coming up, I'm gonna be rocking with Corey Guns out in Miami. Words, crazy. Okay. See, so you got that Marlins hat on. You getting ready early? See, <laughs> <laughs> so you yeah, getting ready so early though. <laughs> you know, I'm yeah. going out there, in New York. They they're gonna be you. mad at me. Huh? The mellow jersey on, like, what's up? Right. <laughs> That's how you gotta do it, though. Represent out of town. Word up. All right, hold on. We got we got a call real quick. We got a call real quick. UEG Radio, who's this? <laughs> UEG Radio, you live on direct right now on the air. Who we speaking to? All right, call back, call back when you get the chance. Call back. All right, brother. So, uh, aside from Miami, man, what's been going on with you? Uh, <sighs> working on this 5K concert. Okay. Um, Real big, real big. We've been running this since like April. Um, I'm the headliner with Ron Browse, Pat Poos, Fred the Godson. We just been rocking out in Brooklyn, um, and we're gonna give somebody five G's. Nice. Oh, crazy. Nice. What can so, I do to so, get the, so the, the five G's? <laughs> <laughs> that was my question. So the winner gets five G's. <laughs> yeah. So we had a series of five shows. Um, you're gonna basically you open up for each headliner artist within each show, so you have three opportunities to make it to the finale. Um, so we got about 17, 18 artists. Um, the finale is actually September 21st okay. out Club Langston in Brooklyn. Nice. Okay. 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 Yeah, Word up. Yo, okay. it's, it's, it's love out there. They, they, they don't like the Bronx either. <laughs> you know, it's real talk though. Listen, they yeah. smell you when you go out there. Man. <laughs> Shout out to my girl Sonya Blade. I know she's checking in. You know what I'm saying? But listen, when they, when you go out to Brooklyn. They know you're not from Brooklyn. They don't know yeah. whether you're from the Bronx, right. Queens, or whatever, but they, they know, know you're not, you're not from, Brooklyn. from Brooklyn. That's you're what right. they know, they for sure. Matter. It don't matter whether you're black, Dominican, Puerto Rican. You're a different color when you're over there, even right. if you are the same color. You're like just, a it's a country to me, man. Like, your, like, clothing, <laughs> your clothing tells you. Right. Your clothing separates you, right. Right. believe right. it or not. Yeah, true story. True story. Yeah. Like soda pop, teas, and like, you know, they <laughs> represent. They say, no, they say, listen. Oh, that's Brooklyn-based, so we good. Right, they say, we good out there. They said it's not a borough, it's a blood. Thank you heard what Mr. Y and, 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 and Big Sense was saying last week. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. I'm you good. good. We I'm good right good. here in the Bronx. I'm good. I'm good. We hide out right here. I pass by in the cab. We good. I'm good in the Bronx, man. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a little Westchester. Maybe yeah. a little Just from Westchester? Mount Vernon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> no. Is that from Westchester? No, I don't do that. Uh, <laughs> All right, back to Coney, man. Um, Coney, being that you started writing early, I mean, I, I read your bio. Seven years old? Is it yeah. your first? Yeah, it was, it was a terrible verse. Do you remember verse. it? Ah. No, it was a terrible verse. <laughs> it was terrible. It was terrible. <laughs> we, we, scrapped, we scrapped that from the book. <laughs> How do you? I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. How do you feel you've grown throughout these years, man? Um, I'm right, man. I mean, personally, I feel like where I'm at now is I'm comfortable with being an artist. You know, um, coming up, it was really about bars, and and I still push my pen. I think that's the most important thing to right. do. But I'm I'm more focused on being a complete artist. My my artistry. I rather write music that people can relate to. You know what I'm saying? I, I keep the bars on tap because people want to hear that every now and then. They want to make sure that you. He from New York? He from the Bronx? Yeah, let me see what he about. But then when you buy that album or, or you download that mixtape, you, you want to hear art. Right, right. 
right, right. You know what I'm saying? Right, so right. it's all about a, a healthy balance, and I feel like that's what my, my biggest growth is at. As as time has gone gone by, obviously the, the, the game has changed and the, and the whole have you had to to adjust with the times or are you you know how um, how, how did you deal with that? I, I think a lot of it for me personally is is just being able to be in a scene. Um I haven't had to force myself to adjust. It's been more of a I'm around this type of music, I hear what the people wanna hear. Um, so I'm able to to just jump right on that wave. Right. And, and it's not so much of a, a learning curve, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm, I'm out here. Right. I know what's right, up. Right. It's, it's different for the artist that spends 24 7 in the studio and never goes and see what the people want to hear. I relate a little bit to this because me, I, I, for some reason, I can't keep. My nephew told me something the other day. I, I'm, I'm not that old. I'm 29. My nephew's like 19, 20. You know, he hit me with some street lingo and I said, What? Uh oh. <laughs> what did he say? Oh, well, I forgot what it was. Something crazy. I said, mm-hmm. "What the fuck are you talking about?" <laughs> and he looked at me like I was crazy. I said, "Damn, you know what? I'm getting old, man." That's crazy. I'm getting yeah. old. Yeah. So I but, can imagine with the game, you know. I mean, I mean, for me, it's it's, it's a little different because for me, it's, it's usually um, you get a lot of the questions. Oh, you you do a radio show, so how do you feel about this song and how do you feel about that song? And I don't know. I I don't do the mainstream like that no more. So for me, it's a little bit different to feel right. some type of way about the mainstream because it's not my focus. I'll listen to it obviously because at times, I mean, you you, you kind of have no choice. Not that right. there is no choice. You kind of have no choice depending on what your circumstance is. Right. But it's not my focus. Like my children, for example, my oldest, uh, my two oldest, they were asking me um, something about uh, Jesus. I can't even remember the name of the song right now. Um, but I know it had to do. I know something had to do with Bobby Schmurder, um, and then another, <laughs> and then and then another artist. And uh, but yeah, remember, Dad, you you heard this before, and I'm over here like, okay, yeah, sure, no problem. Cause that, I, I probably did. I probably did hear it at one point. Right. But I'm always. I'm my, my again. My focus is unsigned, so I zone out when I listen to my whether it's listening to new music or just listening to the, the regular music that I have on my phone right listen, now. Most of my most of my phone right now is unsigned artists. Real you talk. Know? Like most of my right. phone is unsigned artists. Like. Sometimes, you know, Cindy is sent over, Juice is sent over some, Y is sent over some. Yeah. You know what I mean? Everybody's sending over records, and I'm just downloading and listening to it on the train ride. Yeah. I, you know what yeah. I mean? I'm on the ground most of the time, so there's no Pandora, there's no tune right. in for no right. Power 105 or Hot 97. Agreed. It's just straight yeah. indie music. So That, or you might find that artist that knows you have a radio show and be like, yo, listen to this real quick. All the time. All the time. I want All to, the time. I want to say at least three to three to four times a week. Easy. Yeah. No, no question. Especially like if I'm promoting right, right. the show Thank like you. a day or two before the show, yeah. Everybody's not sending me records. Yeah, yeah. Like it just it's just what it is. Yeah. But before we move on to the next question, I have I have a question for you. We were talking about earlier about business. Yes. Um, and what that looks like. What is your, your meaning behind it? Like when you hear the word business, what does that mean to you? Um, you know, brother Mike spoke about presentation, um, commitment. We also spoke about integrity. When you think about the word business, what what does that mean to you? Uh well for me, I would definitely run along the lines of integrity because um when you're handling business you really don't have much but your word and and understanding what's good business and what's bad business you know what i'm saying um in, in times before money was so much of a priority people worked on the barter system so they understood good business you know what i have to offer as a trade um for what you have to offer as a trade so that we could both prosper mm. so um definitely you know what i'm saying maintaining that integrity is important to me. That, that was good right there. Yeah. I'm glad I asked the question. That was good. That was. We learned like, something. Wow, today. Okay. We learned something today. That is a you know? word that is used often, but I don't think that people understand, understand the true meaning of integrity. Like integrity, integrity is like you said. It's about keeping your word, but. For people who really understand not just the business world, but just overall, integrity also means doing the right thing when nobody's watching. Exactly. Agree. Exactly. That's what Agreed. integrity is. That's, that's where the payoff is, actually. That's where the payoff is. Because you, you just never know who you're going to run into. And exactly. you just might find yourself in a circumstance, whether it is, like for us, everybody has something else that they're doing. So whether it's working that city job, whether it's working um, out, of the, out of the borough, whether it's working the nightlife, you know, who you are when they're listening to the radio and who you say you are when they're listening to the radio uh, and seeing you in person, whether they're speaking to you or not, because that's the thing. Sometimes they might introduce themselves to you, but then there's this thing called intimidation, mm-hmm. you know, where they might be intimidated to say a few words either because of the job that you have. 
But for them to look at you and say, you know what, this person is actually who he says he is or she is who she says she is, is very important. Which is also on the side note why I keep it so 100 and so authentic with, with my people that send me music. Like, I'm not going to tell you I'm going to play your joint if it's whack. I tell you before, once you send me a record, before you send me a record, I'll tell you off the bat. If, I if do my need, radio show. God damn. No, no. If it needs work, you know. I'll let, let them know. Let's be politically clear. No, absolutely. You know. <laughs> I, I've told, listen, I've had people, I, I'll even put this on, on the air. My boy Wyatt sent me a record for the album. He sent me two versions. He sent me version A, he sent me version B. Why is my dude? I kept it a buck with him. Because I feel like you owe that to people. Right? You do. You owe it you to do. people. If you hang around a bunch of yes men you or people broke. who tell you you don't want to do that thing. Yeah. You have you have to you have to give you have to be willing as an artist, as a DJ, as as entertainers, as show hosts, we have to be willing to take that that feedback. Positive or negative, it's, and if it's, it's negative, you yeah. make it a positive. Yeah. Definitely, you understand it's, what I'm saying? It's, it's the C and C process. You got to be able to accept the compliment as well as the criticism. Absolutely, there's just no way that you can only just sit there and be like, "Oh, so you didn't like this one? And you there, didn't like that one?" There's not it's one just, person that's that's successful in this industry. For everybody who looks up to to whether it be your Diddy's, your Rick Rosses, your your Meek Mills, your Oprah Winfrey's, whoever, all of them, you might see them at a certain level now. But they have all go through that that feedback, and believe it or not, even with them having the success that they have right now, they're still getting feedback that may yeah. not be the most positive. Right. Where okay. they have to still grow. Agreed. Because in this game, even if you reach what you believe is the pinnacle, you still have to continue to grow, yeah. because the game and everything evolves. And if you don't grow with it, then you're going to be left behind. I agree. I agree. Hold on. We got we got a we got a phone call right here. UEG Radio. Who's this? She Martinez. I'm sorry, who's this? Shit. Break it up a little bit there, yeah, homeboy. Break it up. Try, try to call us back in a minute. There's something wrong with the line. Try to call <laughs> us back in a minute. Um, it's true. Right. It's true. And I think um, the reason I asked that question about business is because sometimes you look at everyone who's involved within all the similar business that you're doing. Um, and, and using that, that specific phrase, which is, you know, serious inquiries only or seri serious business inquiries yeah. only, and you look at the person who's asking for that yeah. and how it doesn't match Yo. because of their habits or because of the way they handled business. You know what I mean? Yo, so that, that was kind of my, my reasoning behind well, why I asked. You talk about because, of, you know, sometimes. Man. Yes, exactly. Reputation plays exactly. a lot in it, man. Exactly. You know, because you know, I mean, hey, I'm not, I'm not knocking that, that person for trying to go that route. But then if that's what you're going to do. You got to hold yourself to that standard. Right. All the Agreed. time. You know what I mean? So that, that was kind of where I was going with that. And everybody kind of hit it on cue from, from, from Mike. To, it went in stages from Mike to Johnny to Miss Sarah, who was with us, and now with Coney. Everything hit it, you know, where it should have gone. And, I'm, and hopefully these are the people that are listening. So, so now my question to you is, was that, was that topic inspired by any recent activity? You know what? I got to say it was. One because as as, as as an <laughs> as an entrepreneur as a businessman, um, and I hate you. Um, <laughs> you know, you kind of have to to, to, to self um, evaluate yourself mm -hmm. and see where you are versus where you want to be. Um, and there's times where you kind of you're overwhelmed, and I said that a few weeks ago. You know, and we've had this conversation, um, and you put these plans together, and you sit and you talk and you sit and you talk, and everything looks good in that first initial sit down or a week later or whatever that may look like but then here comes a month month and a half two months later and you're still looking at this page realizing that you haven't touched anything that you spoke about so now you got to put yourself in that position and say okay well why is it that you haven't put yourself in that right. position because at the end of the day it's just that credibility like you can talk to your blue in the face about what you can do but until you do it i'm sorry to use this word or this term but you ain't shit Listen, right. we keep it a bucket. You telling the truth. You know what I mean? So That's for me, like to. me t talking about that is kind of also just you learn every day. Every day you learn. And there's not one person that can say that they're not learning something new every day. You know, no matter what age or what level of education you're in, you're learning something new every day. I agree. So you also want to you also ask these questions because you also want to know if you're going in the right direction. Right. You know what I mean? Um, and for me, every time I'm asking questions or every time I'm doing something, it's because I want to be better than who I was five minutes ago, five days ago, five years ago. Because that's the only way that I'm going to get to that next level, not just for me, but for the people that I work with and those that I have around me. 
don't be afraid too. Like when you talked about getting better, don't be afraid. First of all, you have to surround yourself with like-minded individuals. Agree. Yes. Agree. That's that to me is very important. Like you, if you want to be a successful person, um, I feel like you have to surround yourself with people who are motivated to go in the direction you're trying to go to. True. You also, and I always say this, you cannot be intimidated to have people around you who are perhaps even smarter than you are. Yeah. Yeah, no, 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 of course, of course. No, but listen, you say of course, but there are some people who are intimidated by people who have more experience, people who have more knowledge because they feel like they'll be overshadowed. Some of the some of the brightest people, some of the people who have achieved the most, is not necessarily because they're the smartest person. Like just because Diddy is Diddy doesn't mean he's the smartest person Agreed. in the bad boy camp. Agreed. Right. He might be the front man and he might be the person that handles the business and Diddy's a very intelligent person, but that doesn't mean that he's necessarily the smartest person in bad boy. Right. Well, if anybody remembers for a while, Diddy actually was just the face. The man that was holding it down was Mr. Harvey. Absolutely, yep. that was the man behind everything. Right. Just when you talk about the other, the other, the other foundations like Rockefeller, you know, Jay Z may have been the face, but Dame, Dame was Absolutely. the mindset. And even though Biggs wasn't talking much, he was that other element Absolutely. to making it work. You know, so everybody has, you know, again, it's going back. And I think everyone's here seen that that video um, that went viral about Dame talking to D DJ Clue on the bus. Yes. Yeah. You can't be a one person team everyone on the team should have the same knowledge of how this works how it moves where it will go and how to get there together because yeah. if one person goes down then what happens the whole shit flops right right you know what i mean so again what you said is true but what people have to remember is that today that person may know more than you but the more you keep on interacting, the more you keep on observing, the more you keep on studying. Absolutely. At some point, you'll be at the same level. Who knows if you'll if you'll surpass, surpass right. what they've been doing? You know what I mean? But it's all about your dedication. It's all about your commitment. It's all about really about being honest to yourself. Mm -hmm. And again, what she spoke about, which is being truthful to your brand, which is respecting your brand. You know what I mean? Because ev everyone can make up names of companies and organizations and this and that. But if you're not actually following through with whether it be the mission of what you're putting together or the slogan of what you've given this company, then what's the point? Right, you got to build a team that sees the bigger picture. Agreed. Right. Agreed. You know what I'm saying? I, I've come across so many people who you down because it sounds cool. This person's popular. Uh, this person has a good idea, but not everybody sees the bigger picture and that's usually when things fall apart listen <laughs> listen I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna i'm gonna keep it a buck with you like i posted something like that two weeks ago i was a i'm a product of that i am a product of that somebody who came out and you know what i mean put together the whole team major situation and then you had to kind of like dissemble and step back and then you had to like get smarter you had to get intelligent right. and you had to Make sure that everybody who rocks on the team, like you said, sees the bigger picture. Put somebody down just because, oh, that's my people. That, yeah. that can't work. Not if you're trying to really accomplish yeah. anything. What, and I think one of the things that we're leaving out, just so we can continue with the interview, one of the one of the biggest things that we're leaving out is that you cannot, cannot be afraid to fail. It's part of the process. Oh, well, yeah. You we cannot be afraid. Mistake. So Definitely. if you know that, you know what, you have 10 different plans that you've put together to see where you'll, you'll be at, uh, within the time frame that you're giving yourself, you know, understand be successful. Right. Who knows? You might have seven of them that are not successful, but that doesn't mean you shouldn't try them. I agree. You know, and, and, and in all honesty, this I'm saying for myself because I've had to put myself in that in that in that frame of mind to understand that you know what, regardless of what I'm gonna do, if I don't take that initial step, I'm not gonna move. So at some point, I just have to take, regardless of what happens when I take that step. Right. I have to take that step. You know right. what I mean? So, good combo today. Good combo. Absolutely. This is like this is like UEG therapy no, right now. No, it is. It is like it is like you know what I mean. It's nice to have people in the in the building who who do more than just entertain. You know what I mean? Who actually have you know content, some intellect. Yes, yeah, some content. Got a little bit to talk about. That's what's <laughs> up. Yes, sir. So, Colin, let's get back to it. Um, what recent projects have you worked on or projects that you you already put out? I dropped the EP in um, April. 
Titled Rise of the Apes um, I got a feature with Persia um, From the White Rapper Show Shout out to her Shout out to Persia the Big homie um, <laughs> She gets busy Yo She yeah. is a savage Beast yeah. She Persia. is a savage yeah. Beast <laughs> Yeah. Um, got to work with my boy Hollywood Play, pretty stizzy. Um, rocked out with my hit em brothers. Then um we dropped the album, first day of summer, hieroglyphics. Um, didn't want to go feature crazy with that. You know what I'm saying? Just I really kept it kept it you. Yeah, that that was that was the goal. You know what I'm saying? Um I got my dude L V G. A little bit of uh spoken word on that joint. Um R and B feature. And then for the extended play I got to work with joint with my boy Teddy Grams. But um, just a whole lot of me, you know what I'm saying? A whole lot of hip hop. Okay. So I was trying to keep it. All right, all right, I hear that. All right, so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have, have a, I'm, I'm gonna go through a question that uh, my brother likes to ask a lot, which is the, and that's my brother Dogs, by the way, that he likes one worders, one worders. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna ask you something, and then just one word that describes exactly what it is that I'm asking you. So, a love that you have that no one knows about. Dance. Uh oh. Okay. You doing uh, this money dance now? <laughs> I you say you're being broke. I, I get busy. You do this, are you doing this money dance is what I'm asking. All I'm saying is, I, I get busy. Oh. <laughs> uh, what would you be doing if you weren't making music? Teaching. Okay. One word that says who Coney Brooks is. Put me on the spot with that one. <laughs> ah. said, you got me with that got one. Him. Um, amazing. Okay. One thing you would do over if you could start from scratch. Nothing. That's a great answer. Wow. Love it. That's a great. Best song you've put out to date. The Message. Five years from now. It's one word, though. On. Nice, nice, nice. Um, okay, this person's been calling for quite some time, so let's take this call real quick. Let's do it. UEG Radio, you're on the line. Who's this? Hi, it's Boss Lady 523. I could have put, put money she was calling it tonight. That's you Boss Lady. So she represents that in, queen. Guys, I'm really angry right now because a truck just rolled through here and pulled down the freshly put up Tom Water cable line. So I can't even lock back in. Wow. Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that, love. I'm sorry to hear it too. Okay. I'm not my phone. <laughs> well, listen. Listen, if you if you on your mobile app, if you on your phones right now, you can get onto that TuneIn app or that Grogle Me app, and you can continue to listen to the show. All right, just download no, the TuneIn app. Grogle Me. Into you straight from my phone, y'all know I'm broken and I'm not broken right Listen, y'all get me an iPhone. I was trying to plug up my stuff. You know what I'm saying? I'm, <laughs> like, I'm broke. <laughs> Can I forget I your plugs, Mike Page? I'm broke. I didn't log out. That wasn't my oh, fault. I'm was totally funny. enjoying the discussion of deep integrity. That is what I have been preaching <laughs> all week. Everybody knows that. Y'all seen me. Coney, I love you. I hope for the fix is so hot-ish. I love you, too. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She was, tell, she was like, yo, play these records, Mike. I'm like, I got you, son. I got to play them records. Coney gets played on the Simply Margo show. He closes my show out every week. I hear you. Go. There you go. I give him something to work with okay. every Friday night. Hello. Hey, hey. That's love. Thank you, Queen. Check out that Simply Margo on that BX records, though. With that. <laughs> Thank you for calling in, love. Of course, and I miss, I miss you. You'll miss you, yeah, baby. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> all right, guys. Enjoy the rest of your show, and I'll see you on Friday. Call me Brooks. All right, all right. Bye, everybody. Later, 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 mama. She you got to love her. You got to love her. There's no broke. way you can. You got to love her. <laughs> she kept it a stack, <laughs> though. I'm not mad. You know? Listen. Um, if, if there are any, what are some recent projects that you're working on um, or that you've worked on to date? Um, well, I'm currently working on an EP. Um, well, I'm working on a double mixtape with Teddy Grahams, um, an EP with Zay Rhymes. Um, my next EP, and I started this series last November called Five Barrel Terrorists, and I'm looking to do the volume two. Okay, okay. And talk to us a little bit about that. Like, what was that? What does that look Five like? Five Barrel, that's including Stan Island? Because, you know, Stan Island. Yeah, no, I, I include the island yeah? on that joint. Yeah, Stan Island is like, you know. Yeah. I understand. Forgotten, <laughs> <laughs> Forgotten, Forgotten Borough. Forgotten Borough. But really? um, they'd be like, what? 
<laughs> that's that's a little coast to coast series I started. Um, just pretty much around when the the Trinidad James foolery oh, started. God, uh, then we just we, we smoked about him last week. Uh, we, I'm, we gonna let the man live. So well, <laughs> we, we gonna let the man live. But when when that started, a lot of the criticism that we got back on the underground scene was that New York don't support each other. And um, it's a it's a, a whole nother generation of New York artists. Yeah. That's that are indie and underground and coming up. They got a lot of accolades, and we have our own network. So I'm like, why not unite to show that we can do what Khaled's doing? Mm-hmm. We can go in and, and mm-hmm. do what these <laughs> other artists are doing to to How uplift you? the city. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So uh, we did the volume one, crazy number, like sixty thousand hits. Um, and we looking to make volume two even bigger and even better. Nice. Listen, Coney Brooks, you're like the third or fourth artist in a row. Real rap, right? In a row. That has said the exact same thing about New York artists, you know, having music, having talent, collaborate, come as one, and, and do what they're doing. So so it seems like a common theme right here on UEG Radio. We starting to see the oh, bigger oh, we picture. Got, we got some, we're going to talk about that later. I, got, I was thinking about something earlier, and then his, his saying that kind of clicked that switch again. So, uh, Spring at the end of the show, we're we going to be talking. But uh, what we're going to do right now is get to a quick music break. We're going to rock out to some of the best hits, some of the greatest hits, and some of the current hits that Coney Brooks has out right now. Yep. But you already know what it is, man. UEG Radio presents Untouchable Wednesdays only on NightlineRadio.com. I got I to I I let I will walk him into this. Now, listen, I'm going to walk him into this. I can't play that record first. I got I to I walk him into this because when I get to that record, I'm going to turn the studio into, into like... HD, I'm telling you. Hold on. Yeah, I already told Coney before the show. This is going to be HD. So we're going to chill for a second. Big shout to the boy Coney Brooks. He's in the building. All right, the first record we're going to play is called The Come Up. All right? You know what it is. Nightline Radio, UEG Radio. Let's do it. Shout out to my girl, Boss Lady. What's up, though? Simply Margo on Friday nights, you know. Rose, fill a glass up halfway. Cigar smoke, treat the world like an ashtray. King shit, no luggage in the Louis Duffel. Whole city on call when the guards tussle. Rose, fill a glass up halfway. Yep. Cigar smoke, treat the world like an ashtray. King shit, no luggage in the Louis Duffel. Whole city oh, on God call when the guards tussle. Only the for the globe touching my arm yeah. muscle. Verbally, I'm a pit stuck in a strong muscle. On my Louis the 13th with this Remy. The Bronx ain't buzz like this since Remy. Let's go. I'll be on my BI facing gallons of Henny. Consistently contemplating me loading up the semi. Ain't that let it go. Reload, snuff they nose. The kickback might break they bones. A murder move and ask if you serious Jones and be a T Rex. Nothing but a bunch of bones. Lady G, what's up? I'll be damned if you taking it. Built my own buzz and blew up on some Mason shit. Three rappers, even let them get a taste of it Just to murder every rapper breathing on some chasing shit uh, It's the come up Let's go It's the come up What we call this wreckage, y'all It's the come up Yeah, let's go This is I reside in the real barrel with lost dreams Knuckle game like Mike, drug him and toss fiends Keep a residual grind and I do it off theme Fire in my eyes like I am Lucifer's off New York, let's do it Bread to be the breadwinner all together Punching clocks and sunny and stormy weather Whether we let the maintenance of treasure sever the competitors If it's time to go to war, it's whatever, it's whatever. Forever on my get it till I got it, stop it Rap got me on the rise like a rocket Buzzing like a socket with a cellular device plugged in it While it's ringing with no one around to stop it Look, 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 lost profit, poetry and secular motion Godlike with a flow like the ocean Tony Brooks, I hear you Rough in certain spots, adapt to any form And it bubbles when it's hot, scorching like the pot from J to C, pass a mill when I'm dashing for the rock. Uh, it's the come up. Let's go, Coney Brooks. It's, it's the, the come up. up. Yeah, New York. It's the come up. Let's do it. UEG. Real nigga testify while you preaching it. Professor to you rappers that be teaching it. Sticky finger web slinger on my Peter shit. Throw on a beat, I guarantee I'ma eat it. Make your favorite MC approach you with a head nod. Cause if my tip of flare is somebody better be on. Yeah, oh, let's go. Hung low like a flag in a crisis. Midlife stuck on my sixth wife. We all tight. Left the game early so all my niggas could ball, right? Stay mellow, I'm back to have a LeBron night. I speak to the creator while creating my fate. Strength the plate, let the aces cut faces of rappers who didn't make it. Claiming I'm on sacred when that order marks 
handshakes chafing I'm basting, sewer water underneath the basement The railroad from underneath the pavement Jungle of concrete Crazy. Round table of pharaohs, put your drinks up. Toast to the cowards around trying to thank us when they should thank us for the blueprint. I mean, I think Ness said Big L, hold up. Coming up, I couldn't make a pay attention. Now, you said Big L, hold up. Rest in peace to the legend, y'all. Mention. <laughs> New York, get ready. Now give me something to work with. Get that bass drop, you twerking. Yeah. That wave right, you surfing. Don't play nice, I'm surfing. That Birkin is product of splurging. You see? Yeah. Red bottoms turn up. Rock with the king. Yeah. New York City, let's go. Crazy New York. Now give me something to work with. Tony Brooks said, now give me something to work with. Hey, let's go. New York City, I'm here. Tony Brooks said, New York, give me something to work with. Yo, Shorty, just give me something to work with. Now give me something to work with. UEG. Listen, New York. We only play a party right now. Work it, that bass drop, you twerk. Yeah. That wave right, you surfing. Don't play nice, I'm surfing. That Birkin is product of splurging. You see, see, red bottoms turn up. Rock with the king. I'm not playing. You looking like a model in the picture. Certified down before the Instagram filter. I'm trying to find who came in here with you. see that face though? Slide now. Okay. <laughs> New York, listen. Now give me something to work with. Yeah, two, three. Yeah, let's go. Hey, now give me something to work with. UEG, Tony Brooks said, give me something to work with. Yes. Only on UEG Radio, we live right now. Let's go. Now give me something to work with. Right, you surfing. Don't play nice, I'm surfing. And Birkin is product of splurging. You see, see, red bottoms turn up. Rock with the kid. <laughs> you looking like a model in the picture. Yeah. Certified down before the Instagram. What up, there? I'm trying to find who came in here with you. Just so we can slide now. Okay. YOLO, I rolled in here solo with no. It's like a retro, like Soho. Car goes on waistline. Tank top is polo. Wristwatch counterclockwise like a robo. It's simple. Big bank tipper. Big nickel, nickname the big dipper. Yeah. Let me get with you, girl. I'm trying work. Tony Brooks, what's up? You ain't going to work. Yeah. What we said, name of this record is give me something to work with. Tony Brooks said, give me something to 
Hey. Shout out to that boy Teddy Graham. Yeah. Now give me something to work with. Let's go. Don't forget the anniversary party next Friday night. Riverbank, you know. Hey. I ain't looking for Miss Right in the cut. I'm trying to find mommy that wanna slide in the cut. Pride in the cup, she could sip to that and let me slide in the gut. That box Christmas wrap. Okay. Yeah. Shake it like a red nose, broke it down, percolate. Eagle do the freak, arch it back, let me permeate. Do it for the vine, hit a split, do the name. Twerking for the god, like you trying to ice JJ. Shake something, start moving on the beat. Yeah. That dress means so you leaving here with me. Uh huh. You know you wore that for me. Shake something now. Give me something to work. Let's go. I know them girls mad that you wave. Boss Leanna, what's up, my man? Get up like a lady. Yeah. Bliss situation, the club going crazy. We up against the wall like we trying to have a baby. We said. One, two, three, four, five. No, that's the sky. We said. One, two, three, three, four, four, five. UVG said. We said. Just give me something to work with. Hey. Like I said, the big homie Coney Brooks is here. This that hit single we call it. Just give me something to work with. Weekends, weekdays, the play date. Let's vacate to the spring break so you can scream, oh God. Atheist, brush them to the side, I'm the waviest. Have you on fresh coats, you can swear I wasn't. Nice. Cause I started from the bottom, now I'm here. Together we grind, we gotta shine like Mark Bliss. It's the home of Big Pun. I'm pretty ugly with the flow. No matter the sex, see, I wear hands. In rotation. You're bad, so I'ma put you on punishment. You get him sick, baby, you know ill, so tell them mothers to fall back. I know Keenan, Maddie, Carol, cause you all lack. Give me something to work with. Oh, yeah. That's all, I'm that boy, the beast bear, the poor, who slap ass like the backboard. Baby, your body classic, and the finer fabric, give you my all like you hold a ratchet. Uh, one, two, three. Welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> Welcome back. No, no. UEG Radio presents Untouchable Wednesdays only on com. It's your boy Elliot Ness. Crazy. Jack Stone is in the building. Mike Major, and of course, the man that just destroyed your speakers, Coney Brooks, is in the building. Um, I'm going to put it out there. They can start off the conversation with um. <laughs> Real quick. <laughs> you um, know it's a problem. The, um. and, I, and I don't use the word, but um, um. If DJs that are listening to this show right now are not rocking that no, let them do what they don't want this weekend because they haven't requested it from Mr. Coney Brooks or DJ Mike Major, kill yourself. Man. Wow. Crazy. Yeah. I told you, yeah. we're not disappoint. Yeah. Yeah. Cindy sent it to me on our day for today, Wednesday. Thank you for Sunday or Monday. I was like, oh my. Tough. <laughs> oh my. Thank you. Tough, my yeah, brother. Thank you. Thank Tough you. track, um, radio ready track, club track. I mean, we Crazy. we just sit here. Thank you. Tough. <laughs> Thank you. My my facial expression. Yo, is still. <laughs> off the chain. And I'm looking at Coney. Coney's rapping to the, to his own song. Yeah. But he's also yeah. looking in your direction. I'm just looking at you like, yo, mm. that's just bugging right now. Johnny Stone was in his typical mafia style. He was like, mm. you know, Johnny. I like when Johnny Stone does that. He's in his own. You know, I like to try to listen to the, you know, the beat is so crazy that you got to kind of try to you gotta, eliminate you gotta, the beat to hear, you know. Listen, just the whoop, I like to, you whoop, know. Whoop. That part alone is just crazy. Like, to start off the record like that is just bananas. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, Rotation. I, I, yeah, I can't. Yeah. Yeah. Thank Rotation you. is a must. Thank you. You know, you ain't got to worry about that with me. Um, real quick, I'm hosting the... Uh, <laughs> 
Rebuild and Destroy concert series up at Club uh, uh, Pyramid. Nice. With uh, Glory Ave on the 23rd. Uh, any artists interested? Any artists interested in participating in this event? All I need uh, is info. Hit, please hit me up at Elliot Ness CEO at gmail.com. What he really um, did just now was tell you to participate. Um, <laughs> he was looking at you like in, in addition, you're participating. In a, in, 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 let me make sure I take the email down. In, right. a, in addition, in addition to that, uh, there is a UEG Radio uh, unsigned concert series coming soon. Um, Please be on the lookout for that. That'll be I out. Know, next. I, don't, I don't even want to talk that'll to be, you right that'll now. That'll be out next Wednesday. And that's why he looked at me like um, that. This that'll is... be out next Wednesday. That info, and I'm, I'm saying it on air so I can be held responsible for it. It will be out next Wednesday, um, as well as the unleashing of the ever waiting uh, new UMG logo. I knew you was going to uh, say that with the team and roster. So look out for that next week as well. Nice. Um, but uh, yeah. nah, it's not nice. It's not. Yeah, it's not. No, no because not. this is because see. <laughs> I try to I try to give him courtesies being <laughs> my manager surprises at him. You okay. know what I'm saying? Okay. But every week there's a new surprise that I know nothing about. Understood. Until today. 953. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's cool though. It's I got cool. something to tell you too, but I ain't gonna I, say I it on the air. I, I ain't gonna say it on the air because that's me. Just I'm a little bit more respectful than that. So I ain't gonna say it on the air. <laughs> Really? Jeez. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. What up? <laughs> Colony, it isn't close to my favorite time, but I have one more question uh -oh. for you. Shoot. What do you think you're bringing into the game that nobody else is bringing? I'm bringing true artistry and hunger. I, I look at the artists like Kanye when college dropout dropped. Mm. What what he was able to do for the that, scene. That, that was, that was, I Classic album. Mm. I, I feel that like latest year. I, I feel like that's the energy, that's the feeling that I bring to the game. You know what I'm saying? Um, I love the independent scene. I love the underground scene. I, I want to bring uh that late '90s, early 2000s mainstream sound back to the game where it was. Mm. So lyrical that you couldn't front on it. Mm, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But it was so fun that you had to play it everywhere you went. Yeah. I like, I like, I like lyricism. Well, know? all I'm gonna say, I'm, well, I'm not gonna say it on the air, but just know that UEG Radio and Mike Major will bring that back to New York City. That's all I'm gonna say. Sounds like a plan. Don't worry about it. We got y'all. Mm, mm, mm. So I don't know, but this is my favorite time of it. Mm -hmm. Is it your favorite no, no, go ahead, go ahead. Is it? Yeah, 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 go ahead. Let him know. Question is. <laughs> Let him know. Acapella or surprise me. Oh. oh. These guys are getting this is what I like. last <laughs> couple of weeks. Yo, oh, it feels like oh. type of way. This is what I like. Oh. Mm -hmm. You know what? Uh-oh. No, no, I'm, I'm not going to go crazy. <laughs> he, said, he said, you know what? I was like, uh-oh, gunshot, gunshot. <laughs> but he did say, wait a minute, he did say late 80s, early 90s, right? Mm. Oh, okay, I see where we're going with this. Oh, he's so it's only crazy. right, I'm going to play a throwback beat, though. It's only, oh. I'm going to play a throwback beat, and, and, and it's funny because as much as I respect and love like old school and our culture, I'm not the craziest old school hip-hop fan. But there's this one record that when I hear it, it just, just <laughs> that face you was making when, when that work what was on just just gets me turned up. Let's do it. Oh. 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 Wow. Uh. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. I step into the cypher, start to spit shit till I get ridiculous. So you realize these bars burn like syphilis. Uh. I be Ridiculous, these niggas wanna rap against the sunny bone or that'll wax you on to wax you off if you talk smack. Get smacked up and thrown off for the back of a silverback gorilla. Matter of fact, you talking about the Skrilla till you realize I'm realer than most. And you about to see the comatose MC that'll beat you till the clip get empty. You little femcee, you don't wanna tempt me. My goons run the block for base, so get tagged by them shots so you can meet past the mace. This is disaster space. I drop arms with four arms with four arms. Nigga, go ahead, act away. Sorry, I can get a little carried away. If I do, your little's gonna get carried away. Young nigga with a quick left, right like a killer. Freestyle amazing, but I write like a killer. Henny for the pain, I'm the right type of nigga. Sex on my brain, sip to killer. Sitting with ten women that otherwise wouldn't try me. Young mommies call me Mr. Big like Ron Osley. 
<laughs> Yo, switch it up for me, switch it up for me, let's do something else. <laughs> My bad. Call me Mr. Big like Ron Isley. <laughs> Let's get the needle right though, hold up. Okay. Oh, he, he's giving me that feeling. <laughs> he's giving me that feeling. Okay. Uh. He talking about balls back. Bring the city back. Uh. They asking for them balls back. Telling Coney Bree to bring the city back. Uh. Let's do it. Call the press, the five borough terrorists won't rest Until every week MC gets undressed and redressed And flip flops a thong in a sundress Cause all y'all feminine Strong words from my ox with a pit bull M.O. That kicks hollow tips like AK ammo Gone commando, nuts on you niggas You all on my ball so my nuts getting bigger Humble enough to say thank you but starving So with a price on your head I'ma spank you Pyro, ratchet and clank you, break every bone from your skull to your ankles Detonate a verse to make a whole body levitate and mediate the seance between the soul and the present state I was put here to educate, name an artist in my league from the beginning to the present date I'll wait for you to say something that's bigger than me, no really I'll wait Matter of fact these cats gonna get scraped like the plate when I'm hungry And I'm throwing thunder, come call me the bluffing MC I'm the king of NYC, can't nobody touch me like a TV screen Uh. When I'm spitting that raw spit, shit getting real thick like hog spit, lyrical massacre, rapping faster than two acres, doing the buck fifty in two lanes, too insane. Off my rocket and membrane, Tony the cocaine was lyricism to me. I'm tiger up on the T. The only thing tougher than me is the roots holding the tree. Ain't no hiding from me. I'm hotter than some of the grease, spitting more acid than pee. Born slick. I spit more pip than a Dutch tree. I'm on point like CP. Saying your boss lie, but punchlines connect shitty like P3s. So if it's beef when we meet, you better keep the goons guns or get the. Just like E.T. Compared to how I feel, this is PG. If I could, I'd leave your body in a box like TVs. This goon squad vet is in 3D. BTD, I ride or die for the niggas beside me. K-O-N-Y, and I've been a king from the Dean Stalk. Most cats buckle whenever D's talk. Always on my P's and Q's mobbing when I tee off. Dudes better hit Seattle when they Seahawks. Young Black and Evo, killing for the people. The C4, who want to play back but no TiVo. Is she not a cheap hoe? I'm trying to make a deep throw. What I gotta make your fist pump, bitch Guido. Thugging and the mob and heart throbbing, so believe yo, pockets stay fat on five Jacksons. Tito, almighty renegade, mouth stay reckless, and my swag heavy like that fat bitch, precious. Honestly, the honesty that left me too exposed, so my ring gon' go longer than Pinocchio's nose. My potential is classic like Curtis Blow records. I jump where your head so king me, checkers. I'm in a different rhyme zone, fuck your time zone. Heat in the morning like Alonzo, I pierce souls for the green, no Rondo. Some thigh, two piece combo, Popeyes. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Turn me down. Good. I don't curse much on the radio. Yo. Good fucking night. Yo. What is oh. your social media information for those listening to us okay, right now, please? Yo, um, you can hit me on the gram at Coney Brooks, K O N Y B R O O K S. That's the same thing for my Twitter. Um, check out my fan page, Official Coney Brooks. Um, check out my website. We just launched that, www.coneybrooks.com. You mind if I give a couple shout outs? By all means, my brother. You can do whatever the fuck <laughs> you want. <I'm laughs> Yo, I got to shout out the big homie Chaos for um, helping me with the promo, you know what I'm saying? NYC Hip Hop. Um, Trizzy Barnes, my brother JR. Um, of course, the lovely Miss Margo. You know what I'm saying? Simply Margo. I love that lady. And, and, and everybody that's just been supporting the movement heavy, we just been working. Empire State of Grind, you know, Hustle Mo, um, they got skills. You got Mike fucked up. <laughs> just Mike? And it's hard to get me fucked up over this hip hop shit. Oh, yo, man. That was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was ADD, no rhythm. You no said rhythm. that what was so stupid. Fuck? <laughs> oh, and shout out my street team. Shout out the team, Coney team. All of y'all, I love y'all. Oh, wow. Y'all ridiculous. I love y'all. <laughs> and uh, don't forget to hit us up. <laughs> uh, we are on UEGRadio.blogspot.com. I am Mike Major.com. Shout out TV.com. 
uh, when we're not on the websites for whatever reason, uh, check us up on them apps, Groggle Me, Royal Lo- uh, Radio Loyalty, iTunes, uh, Jesus Christ, Groggle Me, uh, Nightline Radio IR, um, tune in. Uh, I'm going to say something. Follow too. us on that Instagram, Elliot Ness, CEO, everything. Johnny Store 415 with a Y, DJ Mike Major, everything. Dogs Malone, UEG, everything. Um, Nightline Radio, UEG on everything. I mean, right now my mind is still that Seattle Seahawks and all that. Yeah, that, 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 that Seattle I'm, Seahawks. I'm, 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 I'm cooked. Can I'm I say something? I am cooked Popeyes. food right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry too right now. Another done, story. done, done, done. I'm going to say this. Done. And we talked about integrity and saying what you mean and mean what you say. Wow. Never, if I somehow forget, which I don't think I will, that beat is officially retired. Yeah. I've never given anyone that beat to freestyle ever. on. Ever. 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 Remember I told you. Ever. 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 That's love. I appreciate that. Was that was insane, man. We appreciate it, too. It, it was a pleasure, man. Thank you. Oh, I got gifts for y'all, man. I came through this album. Appreciate y'all you, brother. Appreciate y'all. you, brother. Appreciate nice. you, man. Uh, don't forget, we're here every Wednesday, 8 to 10, nightlineradio.com, and the words of DJ Mike Major. Go! <laughs> Have a good one.